why is StreamYard a good program for your live stream? Well, today I'm going to cover that point. I use OBS a lot. However, a lot of people online have started using StreamYard. What is StreamYard? StreamYard is a browser-based streaming service. Let me show you my screen so I can show you a, a view of it. So right now here is StreamYard. So what you can do with StreamYard, if I get my camera out the way here, you can actually stream onto the internet. What's the benefits of that? The benefit of that is you can stream using the internet. So you're not actually needing to have a computer that has a really good graphics card or very intensive processor because that can be tricky. OBS is very processor intensive when you're recording. So the alternative side of OBS is StreamYard. You can get a free membership to it for their basic plan which allows you to set up a room like I have set up here. You can upgrade to another plan where you pay something like $20 a month and you can actually have uh, well better performance you can have manual and uh, artwork and things on there so if I do this enter broadcast studio it allows you to enter your broadcast studio and set up up to 10 people can join your stream it asks you which camera you want to use right now I'm using all my cameras for my live stream uh, my recording software so it's not going to let me use it twice but normally it pops up here you enter and then you have multiple options here for StreamYard. so if you want a program that is going to let you stream online and you have a slow computer you want to use StreamYard. it's very intuitive so if you have a really bad old computer but you've got a good webcam or a dslr or a camcorder or a mobile phone and you want to stream you can add people in as well so there's a few little benefits of StreamYard. the free plan is basically fine to get you up and running but to get the most benefit from it you'd want to get the pay, uh, paid version which is what the professionals would use if especially if you have a lot of meetings and you want to get involved with people so that's a little bit about StreamYard. hoping it explains it let me know if you want to know more about that because i can do a deep dive and explain how to use it but i've made a similar one of these for obs which you can check out here and we'll do another one for zoom maybe i'll see you in the next video